It's the first of the month. You know what that means. Rent's due. Oh, my God. God. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> Thank you. I'm so grateful. Thank you so much. What's up, guys? I'm Tyra Matthew, also known as the Landlord. They call me the Landlord because I own the field and I take care of Chief's Kingdom. But right now, my social responsibility goes much beyond that. A lot of people have been impacted by COVID-19, especially in my hometown of New Orleans. I'm hoping to find a few families that I can really impact and help and love and support. I'm looking forward to checking them out. Hi, Tyron. My name's Sarah Jane, and I'm a unit director here at the Boys and Girls Clubs of Southeast Louisiana. And I'd love to introduce you to one of our families that's been affected by the COVID-19 virus. We've got Marcus, one of our youngest members, and his mother, Tori, who is a healthcare worker who has recently gotten off of quarantine due to exhibiting symptoms with the virus. Um, they're an amazing family to have with us, and I'd love for you to get to know them more. Hey, can you hear me? Hi, Tyron. How you doing? Hey, how you doing? I so can't complain. Yes, I can't complain. I've heard, I've heard so many great things about you and your son, Marcus. I, I hope. Yeah. You know. Yeah. Correct. Yeah. Also, I've heard that you that you've recently um, recovered from COVID nineteen. Yeah. So, yeah. I'm so happy to hear that. Um, uh, I, I have a brother actually that that's a, a registered nurse. So I'm so grateful for you being on the front line. Um, and, and for all that you do. Um, and I'm, I'm so happy that you're back working too. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm excited too. Trust me, the people I work for, they were excited too. Yes, yeah. we were. Oh, you heard my <laughs> boss just said that. <laughs> <laughs> so, hey, can I ask you, like, how, how was it? How was it dealing with the ha having those symptoms and, and not being able to work? How was that? It was lonely. That was, I think that was the most difficult part was being by myself. I don't think I would ever want anybody to have to experience that. Because you, you basically, you know, by yourself and just hoping and praying everything turns out well, you know? I'm so glad that you that you was able to recover from that and uh, that, that you seem to be in great spirits right now. And that's always a, a positive. And uh, I, I'm, sure, I'm sure Marcus, you know, was there for you. And um, so I don't want you to ever feel like you're alone. Um, I want you to know that I'm always with you too. Um, I'm always. I appreciate that. I appreciate that, Tyron. No. You are awesome. You, I have watched you since high school at St. Augustine. Uh -huh. College your career. So I want you to know that I have rooted for you for a long time. I watched you go through your own trials and tribulations, and I'm proud of you. I'm happy for you. Thank and you. for me. To see you win, that makes me feel like home wins too, you know? Yes, ma'am, I appreciate you so much. So, hey, so I know Marcus is living with his dad currently right now, right? Yeah, that's yeah. Marcus. How, how has it been um, having him away? It has been difficult. Marcus is my, my last little child. My other kids are adults, so. <laughs> Trust me, it's been, I miss him. I miss him. No, I bet. So I, I want to get personal with you for just a moment. Um, uh, how, how, was, how was the? How was it financially for you, um, be, not being able to work? Um, I'm basically trying to recuperate from this situation. I normally are, I'm able to go in and work extra hours and stuff like that, but I'm because I do normally take care of one lady at her house, to prevent from anything being, you know, impeding upon her. I have to take that into consideration. Well, you know that, you know my name is the landlord, uh, cause, cause you know, I take care of the field and uh, I take care of the kingdom too. And um, you deserve so much more, you know, being a frontline worker, um, you know, representing my hometown. Uh, you know, like I mentioned earlier, my brother is a registered nurse as well. So I, ha I have I have so much respect for, for you guys and, and everything that y'all do, everything y'all sacrifice um, to, to really protect us. Um, but but I want you to check your phone right now. I want you to check your text for me, please, if you could. You, you know, are awesome. I kid you not, this has been really awesome. I've, I've sent you one month's rent. Um, and, and then my friends at Zell, uh, they're actually gonna donate and match me. So you're actually gonna be covered for two months. Check your account once we hang up and it should be there. Just to have this conversation with you was rewarding for me. Thank <laughs> you, I'm so grateful. I appreciate 
for the donation. I'm, I'm, I'm grateful. I am. I'm grateful. Thank you. Thank you so much. And, and you take care, okay? I will. You too. And I'm going to be watching you when you do get to go back on the field now. I got you. Thank you so much. All right. Thank you.